Well, last night against Detroit, the Minnesota Timberwolves lost more than a game. They lost Zach Levine, their talented young player, who was out for the remainder of the season with a torn left ACL. Levine was averaging around 19 points a game, over three assists, over three rebounds, and having a career year. But unfortunately, he is gone now for the season. Uh, Tom Thibodeau discussing the loss of his key player. Terrible news. It's uh, obviously you feel for Zach, uh, first and foremost, just who he is. is John Brzezinski of the Associated Press, who is uh, at Target Center. John, thanks for being with us. I know you've been around the players today. It must be awfully tough news for them to try to digest. Yeah, it is. We were just in the locker room just a few minutes ago, and it's pretty sullen in there. It's, it's like the air has been let out of the building a little bit. Uh, Zach Levine is an incredibly popular player in that locker room. As Sam knows, it's a tight-knit unit. I mean, he and Andrew Wiggins and Zach Levine or, and, and uh, Carl Anthony Towns are, are very tight um, and really good friends. And so Carl spoke to us for a few minutes basically just saying, what he what he said in his tweet about how how kind of heartbroken he is for Zach and Brandon Rush kind of talked about the knee injuries that he's dealt with and how, he, how you know, the long road that Zach has to get back. They're all wishing him the best, uh, but they're all certainly feeling for him right now. John, Sam here, man. How you doing? Hey, Sam. How's it going? Hey, man. How is when you look at this team and they're young and all these young guys are experiencing a lot of firsts. You know, all these guys were averaging about 20 points a game. They're finally starting to play like we all thought they could. And now Zach go down with this injury. How do you think is this going to affect Carl and Andrew Wiggins, who as part of that three headed monster that the guys were creating in Minnesota with Carl, Andrew and Zach? Yeah, it's a good question, Sam. We'll have to just see how they kind of respond to the adversity that's that's come in here because, as you know, these guys are really durable. They haven't had the big injuries, you know, before this one that a lot of guys go through. I mean, Andrew has played in almost every game. Carl has played in almost every game. Zach had been playing in almost every game in his career. So this is going to be the first time that they've been – had one of them away for any stretch of time, really. And so – uh, it will be interesting to see how they play off of each other, uh, how they kind of respond, and it, if if Zach and Andrew, tr or if, if Carl and Andrew try to take more of the shots on themselves, or if they try to distribute it around with, to the rest of their teammates a little bit more. Uh, you know, Tom Thibodeau said he's going to start Brandon Rush, a veteran, at least at the start of this absence, and and hope that he can bring in some kind of a calming influence on the group. But uh, there's no question that they're shaking a little bit right now, and and so it's going to it's really going to be interesting to see you know how that weighs on them if it does at all uh, once the games start here. Yeah, uh, John, thank you so much for the information. I'm sorry it's under these circumstances because Zach Levine is such an exciting young player to watch. He's one of those ooh and ah guys that uh, is on that Minnesota Timberwolves roster. So we wish him and the team the best as they uh, entertain Memphis and take that first step. Thanks, John. Appreciate Thanks, John. It. Thanks, guys.